I've got a date for you. Yeah. Mar March 1. Yeah, I think so. I mean, yeah, it looks good, yeah. No, uh, no he's hitting the line well, and, that, and that's what you like to see horses hit the line yeah. like that. So, um, yeah, no, I don't know if we'll get another run. We're just to sort of sort things out now, yeah. Well, that's, that's your juggling act, isn't it? Because yeah, you've got to go to 1,400 if you were to go to March 1 for that next uh, step. Yeah, that's right. I could give him a bit of a break and then have a couple of runs before. But, yeah, we'll just see what it goes on here. Yeah. Uh, no, he's a nice little horse and uh, good to see him travel. You know, you bring him down and they, they've got to get used to that travelling, you know, and he, he, he done it really well, yeah. So, um, yeah, good. And he hits the line, but he can take a position too. He can, yeah. No, he's a nice little horse to... Even you do him, he's just a nice little horse, and you know, I haven't worried about gilding him because he just, he just sees you doing it with, you know, and he's, uh, he seems to be growing, so uh, I don't know what we're going to do there. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck with him, Gary. Okay, thanks very much. All right, he's off to the Wagga Wagga qualifiers. So, what does he do? 1400 the qualifying heat on March 1, and he's had 1,000, 1,000, 1,100, but Gary Colvin will know exactly what to do to get him to the country championships at Wagga Wagga for their $150,000 heat.